A special vigil for the owner of a popular Chinese restaurant who was shot and killed outside of his business. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal has more on the call for action and the tremendous loss from the community. The St. Louis kitchen is on Kings Highway just north of Del Mar. The owner had closed for the night, was walking out to this parking lot on May 30th when he was shot and killed. A cook of his was wounded. Current and former employees gathered on the lot where their boss, who went by Randy, was shot and killed. They say Fa Ming Pan provided good food and offered deliveries in a neighborhood where few businesses would. He worked seven days a week. This was his life. This was, this was his everything. And now he's gone for what? Friends prayed for the recovery of a cook wounded in the shooting and reflected on Randy's loss. He was married with two children. Wife had to go home and tell the kids that their daddy gone for taking care of business, you know. I mean, no kind of sense. Uh -uh. Really don't. Nobody had nothing bad to say about this man, and this man is gone, you know what I'm saying? So now the, the business is going to not probably be open anymore. I mean, what the heck? I mean, this don't make no sense. Why? Just tell me why. There are surveillance cameras outside the St. Louis kitchen, and friends hope anyone with information will join them in rejecting violence and recognizing the grief, trauma, and loss that come with it. This is a time to stick together. You know, everybody say, you know, don't, don't talk and all that. We need your help. It's time to stick together. It's time to talk. Because this was senseless. He didn't deserve this. He really didn't. I'm just disappointed in our uh, city. We got to do better. We got to do way better because he was a good person. And coming up on Fox 2 News at 10, just how far the owner of this business would go to help this community. Reporting from the Academy neighborhood, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.